guys, hope you're well. So today I'll be coming at you with a huge array of most affordable lipsticks. I'll be starting off with a range starting from two to 250 bucks, going up all the way to a thousand bucks, all right? I will not be doing the swatches on my lips because this is not a shade video. This is about the affordability and the performance of the product. So I will start off with everybody's favorite lipstick, which is Matte Me. This lipstick is really good. This is the one I'm wearing right now in the shade um, 401. Now this has just cost me, I think about 250 bucks. They have an awesome array of shades. These guys have a shade range like really the top end brands. The performance is really nice. The meal test is what I call it. So after you finish having your meal, does the lipstick stay or does it just leave an ugly ring of pink around the rim of your lips? No, we don't want that girl. Well, the one thing is the applicator is not very, very, uh, should I say fluffy? It's a thin, skinny applicator, giving away a little bit of the cheapness of the quality. But the lipstick itself is awesome. Go for this with your eyes closed. Coming down awesome to Matt Me awesome. now, you can see that the applicator of this lipstick is not very fluffy and big. It's a very thin applicator compared to the others, but the lipstick itself is beautiful. See the color, see the pigmentation and the formula. There is absolutely no problem with this lipstick. It stays on a great deal. It, it works just like a high-end lipstick, guys. This. And the shade is exactly like the one you get in the bottle. Really good one. This one is really value for money. Don't be fooled by the skinny applicator. Just forget it and go for the product. The next hot, hot, hot favorite again is Miss Claire. These are actual dupes for the NYX liquid matte lipsticks, which we'll be coming down to next. The, and this costs around 250 bucks to 300 in some places if the availability is an uh, issue. So I think the Miss Claire is awesome. The one thing you need to remember with this lipstick is the shade you get on the tube is not the shade you will be getting on the lips or even when you swatch it. I'll give you an example. I'll show you by like a shade or swatch of this. You'll see how the tube is very different from the actual lip shade. So this is Miss Claire for you. We will just take a quick swatch of this as well. A very pretty shade, but unfortunately a little bit deceptive. Because the shade you see here is not the shade you expect to get, but it's pretty close. You won't be led too much off the track. Next in we have NYX. This is the original soft matte lip cream. These lipsticks are to die for. Again, very, very affordable at the range of around 250, 300 bucks. It's a bloody steel girl. So these are, they have a decent amount of product that is the 4 ml. Soft matte lip creams. These are like to die for. Here, I'm going to swatch this one here. This is what the tube looks like. they are going to give you the exact same shade which is in the tube so you can when you buy this remember you will be getting a shade very much which looks like what's inside the tube all right i mean if you you know what i mean the tube looks like the shade itself which is not the case with miss, miss claire lipsticks if you go thinking about one thing you are just totally liable to get another shade it's happened the next hot favorite everybody's baby mine for sure is colourpop these retail at 650 bucks nothing compares to them in fact the kylie lip kits are supposedly made by the same company that makes color pop liquids and the formula is reportedly pretty pretty similar so well take your pick 2000 or 650 and they have the best shade range i mean they this are like awesome. is clueless by color pop see the pigmentation it is completely awesome The shade you see is the shade you get. Colourpop is Colourpop, I don't need to say much. The other awesome liquid lipstick I've been loving is the Smudge Me Not Liquid Lipstick by the brand Sugar. Now these lipsticks are little, I think the issue would be like there's not too much of product, 4.5 ml, but it's pretty decent for the range of 550 rupees. They have nice shades, but not crazy mad shades, I guess, like just, it's a good brand. I would be happy if they had more shades. So this now we move up a little bit to the higher end brands. I'll be starting off with NYX. This is for 850 bucks. The NYX Liquid Suede 
lip peels these are liquid lipsticks the they are great with suede snacks you see they do go on a little bit patchy you can see that right so that's a little bit patchy for you they if you, but i'm sure if you go in for the lighter shades you'll probably not have this problem with the light shades of the next liquid suede the next full throttle lipsticks these are really great the pigmentation is awesome the price range is i think 650 i'll have of course have all the prices below as well this is awesome it goes on smooth it stays on that is this no issue the is one. the full throttle again a matte lipstick but not patchy it's an even color i would definitely go for these lipies above those we have think is every lipstick i'm talking about and telling you about will pass the meal test for me that's a biggie i hate finishing dinner and then sitting around like wanting to apply lipstick no girl no that's not me i just want the lippy to be there mac has done that in the long run those lipsticks turn out to be cheaper because you just need one application and you're set for the entire evening all right the next one um i will talk about is not this it's sephora this lipstick stays on i have used this lipstick it's passed the gym test it's passed the meal test this is great this is by sephora i will just give you a swatch of this here see how pigmented that is and this lipstick is not coming off take a lot of and read it but it's very very good value for money they have really nice shades not too many i'm afraid but good shades uh the next one i would i'd like to talk about is the 2000 kisses brand this has got a lot of product in it it's 8 ml that's the most of them all and this is a pretty very nice it performs very well it stays on they've got really nice shades this is the brand 2000 kisses all right so the last one i want to talk about is not a yes this is pretty much a no i'm so sorry but i'll be giving it to you honestly the way it is so this is the matte as hell crayon lipstick mary poppins by the brand sugar again now these once you use them they are just not going to be there after a while there's i won't even talk about eating and drinking and all that they are just going to fade away into nothing if you see i don't have any oil on my fingertips but just do this it's it's gone it's literally gone this is uh, in my opinion not very much worth the buy i don't know how much this costs uh, though i'll of course have the rates down below but this is not a product i would buy again i would i, I got this in a fab bag thankfully i didn't have to spend my money and waste my money on a on a product like this this is probably all right if you're just going down for like an hour or so just you don't need too much of you know like it's not going to be a long evening maybe why not they have nice shades but i wouldn't be suggesting this for the long run no girl no so that was it guys these are all the affordable lipsticks they are awesome i will uh, if you want anything else in lip lipsticks definitely let me know and i will see you soon in my next video don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed this and if you have any more uh, suggestions or requests definitely leave them down in the comments and i'll see you soon in my next one bye your matters hell crayon now i'll just show you this this is in this shade i think it's rethink pink i'll have it down below so i'll just swatch it here there we are now just let me show you how easily see i i don't even have any oil or anything on my finger this is just a dry finger i just kind of just go off